Hi, this is Jason Culp with Nord Technologies, and I just wanted to do a little bit of simulation here with you regarding the printer. Yesterday, we got to go out to uh, a site in Ohio with a client of ours that recently bought five of the HP printers. Uh, we had a perfect opportunity to lay out on a nice clean floor in a very large factory. Uh, right here, I just want to show a little bit of the obstacle avoidance that we had in the drawing. Uh, the printer recognizes where the obstacle is, backs up, turns around, and gets ready to draw the secondary line. Now, some of these lines will be split up a little bit. You'll notice as you put in the obstacles that you may have um, a couple little short lines here or there, and that's just because the printer is optimizing for the best way to print it, um, taking into consideration the visualization with the instrument and also the tailspin on the back of the printer itself. So you'll see here it stops, it'll back up just a little bit to make sure that it has enough room to navigate around. And then it's going to go ahead and turn around and print the secondary small line here that it didn't print the first time. Now the thing to observe uh, about the secondary line is that you'll notice when it prints it, it's right on top of the one that it just finished. Okay, so um, you can see there that the eighth of an inch accuracy that this printer has a good portion of the time, that eighth of an inch, it's, it doesn't even equal an eighth of an inch. It's usually right on. Um, here you can just see a little bit more layout, uh, the line processing. This job was mostly layout and obstacles. There's really not a lot of points, um, door swings, or text in here. Um, they're laying out very, very long, heavy tracking for uh, insulated walls. So there wasn't really necessity to have a bunch of text in there. Here you can see another um, pipe that's supposed to be just on the outside edge of the wall um, and we had verified with them that that pipe actually was located uh, a couple inches in the wrong way so you'll see that it kind of looks like it's interfering with the wall and that's just because the the pipe itself is located in the wrong uh, spot here you can see it takes off right at that corner um, recognizing right where the other line was that it stopped creating a perfectly 90 degree angle and then here we just run along the line. You can see that left tire actually follows that line just perfectly. So you know that the spacing in those lines is, is right on. And here we come up to another line where it creates that corner that we already did with that pipe that we talked about was relocated. And finally, you can see the corners, how they all come together. If you have any questions regarding Icon or HP site print, give us a call here at Nord Technologies and we'll help you out.